In this video, I will show you how you can copy a timeline in Final Cut Pro for the iPad. So you see here, I have a timeline. It's called EN Read External SSD. Also, you will learn in this video how you can actually rename your timelines. But the problem is nowhere here, you can basically just copy them or go somewhere else. What you have to do is you actually have to exit out of this project. And now if you see your project here, SSD storage on iPad, I made an English version of that video, but now I wanna edit the German version. So how can I do this? Instead of going here to edit, I click this. And now I see my timelines and I can, for example, even go in here and change the name of that timeline and I can duplicate my timeline. So now I have a duplicate. I can change that one here. So I, this will be my German version, German version of that video. And I say done. Now I can actually select that one and say edit. And now I'm in my German version of the timeline. I can do my changes and my edits and nothing will be loosed on the first timeline. I hope you liked this video. If yes, hit like, subscribe, ding a ding in the bam bang gong. If you want to learn more about DaVinci Resolve for the iPad or Final Cut Pro for the iPad, then follow us here on this channel. I'm Daniel. See you next time. Bye.